Welcome to Motivational Monday. This is Fedor Azek, Senior Trading Strategist here at CM Trading. Today, we're gonna ask a question that unpacks so many things that it's just so vital. And I don't know how anybody in any industry doesn't use this one question in order to unpack so much potential. But first, make sure to smash the like button, share, and do subscribe, especially if you find value in this presentation. All right, so here it goes. So when I first started trading, one of the most potent questions that we asked ourselves on the trading desk, after setting yourself up, after making meetings in the morning, okay, after spending so much time doing pre-work, okay, and I'm talking about a lot of pre-work. I'm talking about analyzing a handful of charts and having memorized their numbers and knowing exactly what traded what at what time versus what it traded and so many technical things and did we use this analysis that analysis and what time of the day and what's my strategy for the day and what am i going to anticipate and the last question after all the work that we did and we're in a group of people and we're just starting to trade out and ultimately there was one leader who was training us and he would say, have you earned the right? And after all that work, I said, what? Have I earned the right? So then I, you know, instinctively, I said, yes, I've earned the right. So he said, so go ahead, trade it. And it was just as easy as that. But what's the point of me saying this, right? A lot of times we don't put our biggest effort into our work and we are expecting returns that are commensurate because we're hoping that, you know, we did the best we could and, you know, it'll make out. It's not the way to do it. If you've really studied for a test, and I'm talking about just a regular test, I'm not talking about those type of tests that they, you know, construct in order for you just to get a passing grade, you know, to just get that. I'm talking about just a regular test. When you were in high school, when you were in university, you took just an average test. If you did the work, you got a good grade. If you didn't do the work, you didn't get a good grade. And it was just as simple as that. And you knew that. You know, you know that. You really know that. Many times in our lives, we're oblivious in our relationships, whether or not we're putting into our relationships or whether or not we're putting into our work and we're being honest about what and how much we're putting into our work. But there's a telling sign. And it's usually when success lands to a person, it lands to a person in a situation that they put in the effort. They earned the right. And many a times, we let success go because we haven't reinvented the earning the right to hold whatever we've accomplished. And it could be at any level that you could ask yourself that question. And it's a really important question because it really makes or breaks who you are as a person. It makes or breaks your confidence, number one. It makes sure that you're on your game. It makes sure that you're inventing yourself. And it makes sure that you're proactive as opposed to passive in growth. There are people that get into situations in life, and we all get to it, where as a result of it, we're forced to grow. We get into a relationship and our relationship isn't doing well, so we look inwards to see what we can do in order to contribute more to the relationship. We get ourselves only to that point after years of negligence. However, it's a really very dangerous person and a very, very successful person that every six months they recreate themselves and they really recreate themselves because they're answering the question of have I earned the right? Now that I've gotten to this level, have I earned the right? Now that I've got to this level, have I earned the right? And that's really a powerful, powerful place to be because you're always in a growth mindset. And I hope that this resonates with you in whatever personal things that you do in your life. Thank you for joining me for this Motivational Monday. We'll see you here next week.